Hey y'all, so uh, I've actually got some incredibly good news. Um, so, oh by the way, uh, we did some work on a live stream and this is the, um, this is the Goblin Forest uh, so far. Um, so, I don't remember what I did on the video and what I did on the live stream to be honest with you. So, got that all a little bit muddled up, but, um, yeah, we've got the um, the goblin forest going a little bit, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I haven't actually eaten melons yet, which is pretty cool. Um, so this will be the first time. Let's um, let's take a walk over to our base. Um, this is uh, a willow tree, by the way. Oh, what's this? Can bison like? Do they destroy the? Yeah, they destroyed the snow underneath them. That's really interesting. Oh, by the way, oh, I realised you guys weren't here when it was snowing. Oh God. Um. Yeah, you guys weren't here when it was snowing. Uh, because we've got the seasons mod in. Um. It means, well, it means we go for seasons. So right now, I believe we're in winter time. Well, it would make sense considering the snow. Um, we've also dug out this trench here, uh, which I think we're going to make into a river that will flow through the Goblin Village, uh, probably around the back end, it might go around there, I'm not too sure, uh, and we'll be surrounding that with trees. We're also going to be doing a lot more terraforming, um, but that's not what I'm really excited about. I'll show you what I'm really excited about. It is. I am. Boom. Ender chests. Oh, what's so important about an ender chest? It gives us obsidian. And you know what that means? It gets us to the nether. Which is unreal, and I'm so excited for that. Um, I no, I, I was so excited. I didn't actually think through what I wanted to do. I don't know if I want to just head to the Nether right now or place the portals. No, right. I think because um, I don't actually know how much. These drop, but I think seven would be reasonable. And we'll actually, um, we'll grab one of these um, and place it here. <clears throat> we bought upgraded these chests as well. Um, we got quite a few things from um, from like popping up uh, things. Uh, so like popping open the. The look bag, so and uh, look back pads and look bags. We got a rocket. Uh, now to fuel it, we need oil, and oil's gonna be tricky to get. As to my knowledge, it only spawns in the ocean. Uh, no, let's put this down here, right, and we'll grab. Did you grab a tablet? What are we thinking? Oh, dragon fruit yogurt, why not? There we go. Um, actually, I probably should pick out a few different bits of fruit. Um, beef jerky, sure. Mm, let's see, let's see a good food. Um, perfect. Um, no, we don't have any gold, and it's, we don't have any. Uh, so we've got this um, um, fire immunity increases movement speed. Uh, increasing movement speed in lava. Okay, so that's good for the nether. Um. 
with our effect. I mean, okay, so we're, we're probably going to do pretty good in the nether. Uh, now it's time to um, pop these open. I actually don't think I'll need as many as I originally assumed. Yeah, I think that's more than enough. Which is brilliant, because it, it, you know. The one over here is quite barren, um, so we'll put this in here. Um, I do my nether portals really weird. Um, I'm really sorry about that, but that's just how I do them. Um, and then flint and steel. Take some cobble. I probably don't need axes actually now that I think about it. Axes. It's fine. Um, take this. So take you and pop you in here. Oh, we've got some power crystal shards. Yes, please. The more help we can get, the better. Boom, there we go. So we should be able to do, um, hopefully a fair bit more damage, but at the very least, a little bit more damage. Um, <clears throat> right, well, it's time to go. Oh, please, please don't be anything crazy. So this, uh, this stone looks pretty cool. Um, there's definitely like a lot that we could do with it uh, when it comes to like terraforming and stuff. Um, so we'll look into that for sure. Um, just gonna make sure we don't get like attacked by anything crazy. Um, quartz is something that we need a lot of. Um, what is this? All right, it's just this stuff. Right, that's not a big deal. Um. Right, let's go and grab some, well, actually, what's this, what are you? What are you? Oh. Right, okay, well, we just won't touch that stuff. Right, so we've got raw silver. So we've grabbed some raw silver. Um, well, they've got obsidian just laying on the ground. Which is pretty cool. Oh. Where the fuck are you guys? Can I ignore those guys? Yeah, we've got to be very careful. Very, very careful. Um, we haven't. We also haven't spawned in the best place, have we? I mean, this block here is like awesome. What is it? Oh, it's a blackstone. Like the thing from vanilla. Yeah, dude, I'll collect this. Also, grab that obsidian while we're at it. Yeah, why not? Come on, let's go. 
I've been so excited to go to the nether. Um, but I was like, right, I need to record it. Forget how long it takes to. Well, let, let me just get like a. Like a stack of blackstone. And then I'll come back for the. Um, the obsidian. I also hear a ghast. Not good. Not good at all. I also realised that we've only really came across um silver. We haven't came across um quartz, which is like a big thing that we need. Well if you look at the map, we're literally on like an island. Plenty of crying obsidian. Alright, we've got just over a stack. guys don't drop there. Right, right come on dude. I'm gonna need to kill these guys. Oh they were surprisingly easy to deal with. Right, okay, okay. Right, make sure I don't speak too soon next time. Right, um, I think this is what I saw on the mini map that I thought was a uh, crying obsidian. some ores here. Oh actually this is stuff that we need for uh, mystical agriculture but we couldn't get it because we didn't have access to. What I think is interesting is <laughs> the nether is our first source of like actually being able to mine anything um, which is quite funny. I don't think for this effect I can't actually find any quartz. What the fuck is that? I think this is a dust. Yeah, it is. I don't know what it's used for. Uh, what mod is it from? Mystical Agriculture. Okay. Um, but Mystical Agriculture is really, really good at like um, its ability to like play with other mods. So, um, you know, it might be from Mystical Agriculture, but it might like influence another mod. This just drips them. No. Just grabbing this raw silver. Oh, we got some more stuff. I don't know what any of this stuff is, by the way. I'm actually just here for quartz. Um, you know, we worked so hard to get to the Nether, and then we finally get here, and I'm like, yeah. Oh, why are we here again? I mean, it doesn't help that we're in, like, the worst possible place. Um, yeah, that definitely doesn't help. Right, what have we got? So we've got nickel, we've got this stuff, we've got raw silver, we've got raw osmium. We've got this. Yeah, that, you know what, that's pretty cool for, like, a first trip to the nether. Not bad. Yeah, so we are uh, we're getting quite a bit of snow at the moment. That place is getting crowded, which I guess is a good thing. So let me see. Let me go and type uh, oil. Why am I getting this thing to craft plants? Is it the one? 
one that I can actually craft into planks. Um, I'd say I'll need to craft planks to get rid of this stupid thing on the side of my screen. No, I'm just gonna ignore it. I can't. Just mm, settings. Um, Tooltips isn't there. Controls. Accessibility. Um, um, right, um, so yeah, you can give the oil me, which this guy produces uh, oil comb and then um, oil comb makes an oily comb. Lock. Yeah, that's not what I'm looking for. Hmm. Let's see. Let's try. Um, well, beyond and oil. There we go. This is what I'm looking for oil bucket and then oil itself <clears throat> um, right so you can use oily comb in this thing which we actually have one of these with a mixer and a basin to make um, right okay that's not terrible I think we'd probably be better doing it in the centrifuge. Bucket of oil, um, yeah. So oily bee, oily bee can actually only be fished out of the ocean. Oh, actually, that reminds me. Um, water strainer. Right, so we want to do I'm gonna craft these bars. Oh, oh, we've got iron. Mm -hmm. Right, that's it. Go cool. to the bars. There we go. To the hopper. Do two of them for now. Um, Why the two hoppers there? Did I not make two hoppers? I'm sure I did. Oh, I did. I just accidentally made. Well, you know, what are you going to do? Catches fish, junk, and treasure. Requires bait. We actually just want this. Actually, we probably want it three of these. So one, two of them, and then boom. Now you might be thinking, oh, like, why are you? Making these water strainers. And I'll show you, I'll show you. Um, there we go. This one here, and there we go. Right, 
that may be an issue, but I don't actually think it will be, because if I just grab you and put you here. Right, perfect. And you know, I'm sure we're fine on that front. I'm sure like we won't get like a bunch of things spawning. But so you'll see here this scaling up. So we're getting dirt, that's fine, dirt, that's fine, but we can get, um, well actually I'll just show you, mortar, well actually, um, probably best to do sand, so one is a way to get sand, so yeah, water strainer, we can get clay, which is a big one, gravel, big one, Golden iron, you know, that's good, but it's not the main uh, one that we care about. Um, but, like, the fact that we can get that from the water strainer is just unreal. Um, like, these are, like, the main, like, unobtainable ones, or the, the trickier ones to get. So, and there's a lot of things that we need to build that we need clay for. Um, so I think right now um, we're going to harvest some iron. Um, it is quite a quick one tonight to be fair. Um, we're not going to be up late playing Minecraft because uh, I've got things to do in the morning. But I thought, oh, you know what, I'll make a quick episode, we'll cover what I'm doing right now and then you know, we'll pick up when I'm next free. Um, I was just so excited to go to the nether and I did it on stream while well, I accidentally turned that off. Um, and like, I got it all on stream and I'm like, ah, oh, this is so frustrating because I want to like show you guys. Obviously it's like up on the stream if you want to watch it. But like, I, obviously I care about the video series the most because that's where I'm like telling a story and you, you guys are getting like a real insight, you know. The streams are really just like people watching me do like nonsense. Um, you know, there is something where like I'd be, you know, picking up all these crops and all that, uh, and that that's why I'd show on like stream. But like any like sort of big progress, that's where the videos run. But yeah, we should have like a fair bit of stuff here. Uh, one thing I need to um, right, okay. So in Portal Frame, we can't craft it right now. Um, oh crap! I didn't mean to do that. Um, you know that makes sense. You know it would be. A little bit overpowered if you could craft an end portal frame, but I'll be honest with you, we're gonna have to. Um, so I'm gonna need to figure something out um, where, like, I need to make like a crafting recipe that makes sense. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna do that, as you know, that's a little bit complex, isn't it? Like, uh, how do you make, like, an end portal frame? Um, you know, you you want to be using a obsidian, but then... You also don't want it to be too easy to get. Oh, I think you need nine to do it, right? So, like, nine blocks for the portal and then you need the eyes themselves. So you could probably do, let's think. What's well, a hard block to get? I guess a netherite block, right? Nether. Netherite block. Let's see this. So. Obviously it's taking that and then that's getting made with scraps and gold. So what's pretty hard to get. 
Right, so what? Three of them at the bottom, and then what? Uh, a respawn anchor seems about right, so you can cry an obsidian either side with a uh, glowstone. So, probably two respawn anchors at each end. Um, in the center, um, well, it would need to be an eye of ender. Um, yeah, and then the top. Mm. What could you do as a top? That's pretty cool. Um, you could do the top. What, something that's hard to get. Like something that's like extremely hard to get in Minecraft. Uh, but then it also makes sense. Hmm. You've got the netherite, you've got the respawn anchors, you've got the ender eye, and something that, that you can put on the top that will be tricky to get, uh, but also that you can get in the super flat. Hmm. Hmm. I can't think of what I do. Well, it's green on the top, isn't it? Um, yeah, well, it, it's like a green color. Um, do you want to see how blind his eyes are? This screen's hard to get, but I don't know if that's. Hmm. Nah, I don't think that's wise to do the cactus screen. Probably do. Slime balls! You could do a slime ball here, a slime ball there, and then in the middle. In the middle, what would you do in the middle? Hmm. For a portal? You could just cheap out and do obsidian. Or like in a respawn. Hmm. Like, uh, a beacon? Yeah, I think that's cool. So. Uh, netherite on the bottom, so block the netherite on the bottom, right? So imagine, block the netherite on the bottom. Then you've got uh, ender eye, uh, or eye of ender in the middle. Respawn anchors at the either side. At the top you have a beacon, and at either side you have slime uh, balls. Um, or maybe, maybe you could do a slime block on either side. That sounds like an idea. Like I might actually have to make that into like a crafting recipe for the mod pack. Because that's a, that's not a bad idea at all. Uh, on that note, we're gonna end it here. Yes, very very quick episode. I just thought get you guys updated on what's going on. Um, show you guys around the Nether, and uh, yeah, forget that I'm invisible for like the fortieth time. But yeah, peace out guys.